you know, Francis and I were very good friends right from the moment we met. Uh, we're very different. Francis is very flamboyant and very Italian and very sort of go out there and do things. I'm very sort of, well, let's think about this first. Let's not just sort of jump into it. Um, and so he used to call me the 85-year-old man. Uh, and um, But together we were great because, you know, I would kind of be the weight around his neck that slowed him down a little bit to keep him from getting his head chopped off. Uh, and um, on aesthetically and everything, we sort of had very compatible uh, sensibilities in terms of that I was strong in one area, he was strong in another, and so we could really bounce ideas off of each other. But we were very much the opposite in the way we operated and the way we did things. Uh, and that, I think, uh, allowed us to have a, uh, a very um, active relationship. We, you know, uh, uh, we actually had a great time, you know, working together. We worked together on a lot of films over the years. But, um, you know, he helped me get my very, he basically taught me everything about uh, writing and directing. And then at the same time, he got my first film off the ground. And then he helped me get my second film off the ground. Uh, and then later on, I went and produced one of his, uh, film for him. Uh, and uh, in the meantime, I'd worked on films as second unit on things like Godfather and other films like that. I developed uh, with John Millius uh, the script for Apocalypse Now, which he ultimately went on and did. So there was a lot of collaboration between us on all the movies we were doing at that time, and still do. We still sort of show each other movies and communicate with each other about what we're doing. And, um, you know, I read scripts, uh, his scripts, and... And, you know, there's a lot of communication that goes on between us.